today I'm going to show you how to make the perfect vegetable pizza with some extra cheese which will enhance its flavor. The vegetables such as olives, green and red bell peppers, onions will double the taste and temptation. So let's start preparing the delicious pizza vegetable pizza. This is two thirds cup of warm water. Into this I'm going to add one fourth teaspoon of salt. Into this I'm going to add one teaspoon of sugar. Also I am going to add a three fourths teaspoon of active yeast. Make sure you you stir stir it well. Now I will cover it and set it aside for 20 to 25 minutes. This is 1.5 cups of flour. Now I'm gonna add my yeast, which is now one. Cup. Okay, now I'm gonna wash my hands and then knead. At this point, I'm going to add a 1 tablespoon of oil. Now I'm going to pour it. And knead it again. Now it looks like this. Now I'm going to cover it with a plastic wrap. And then leave it for 2 to 3 hours. Or you can do it overnight. I covered it. And now I'm going to put it in a warm place for 2 hours. After two to three hours, my uh, dough is finally ready. Okay, now I'm gonna uncover it. Okay. Now I'm gonna first dust it with salt. Now I poked it around, now I'm gonna take it out. And then I'm gonna roll it with the rolling pin. So now I rolled out the dough and now I'm gonna transfer into the pizza pan. But before I transfer, I'm gonna spray some oil. Now I sprayed it. Now I'm gonna transfer the dough into the pizza pan. On top of my pizza dough, I'm gonna spread my pizza sauce onto the dough. But if you want to see how to make my pizza sauce, I'm gonna leave a link up here or down in the description. Please check it out. So it's very easy to make in a few ingredients. And by the way, it smells so good, you should make it. I will spread it around the dough. Oh, and by the way, I like to have my pizza with extra tomato paste or pizza sauce. So I'm gonna add a little bit more. So now I'm gonna spread my sauce, but I'm not gonna spread it till the edges so that my crust can form. Now I'm done spreading my pizza sauce. So I'm gonna spread a lot of shredded mozzarella cheese on top of the pizza sauce. Lots of mozzarella cheese because I love cheese. So now I'm gonna add my vegetables and they're all sliced. Look right here. I have green bell pepper, red, yellow pepper, olives, and onions. And I slice them and starting off with the onions. my green bell pepper some red so that the color can just pop up and now I'm gonna add some olives 
on my tongue. Now I'm done adding my toppings. I'll add extra cheese on the top. And you can add any type of cheese. You can add like sprinkle some uh, cheddar cheese. Maybe even some Parmesan cheese. Or you can even add provolone cheese if you like. Now I'm gonna bake my pizza at 425 degree Fahrenheit for 15 to 20 minutes or until golden brown. Now my pizza's baked and it's out of the oven. Now I'm gonna slice my pizza with the pizza cutter. So my Vespa pizza is ready and it looks so cheesy and delicious. It has all the flavors of the vegetable, the cheese, and it's so incredibly tempting. So try this recipe at home and I'm sure you will love it. Thanks for watching this video till the end. Please like, comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe for more recipes like this. Bye!